Right everyone, and welcome back to Magello on Forza Motorsport, and we've gone wide already. Um, yeah, this track is unforgiving. It's an all-star track, of course, owned by Ferrari, which is exactly why we're driving Ayrton Senna's 1988 McLaren, and I made yet another mistake at the corner where Max Verstappen crashed in the gravel back in 2020, of course, the only time F1 has raced and then again here it's just gone horribly wrong um, yeah mistakes are well it, this track is definitely not easy to handle but once you get the hang of it um, it is well when I say hang of it I thought I was getting the hang of it there but you know on the second lap I'm still ending up in the gravel um, as well I have driven this track previously on Forza Motorsport 7 back in 2020 so um, yeah it has been a while so we'll see how much I can remember this is the fastest lap and the one and sole good lap that we need a little bit of a twitch there um, excuse me as we that was excuse me at that, that point um, on the rear end but we are a bit wide there not wanting to be that wide but we are up through San Donato and now we're going through them again a bit wide not helpful the fact we're steering one hand because we're on this manual gear stick on this 88 McLaren as well as an all of the F1 classic F1 cars that are in the Forza Motorsport down the hill this is a lovely section I probably feel a lot better in a modern F1 car as well as now we're going to Arabiata um, the first is a double uh, right hander this just feels you get this right it feels so good uh, nine second of another best now up the hill um, this corner I found to be harder to overtake as you'll see in a, bit, a little bit in the race but not too much and then of course we come into this uh, penultimate little section now um, again this corner it opens up make sure you don't go too wide otherwise you will end up going wide um, uh, and then you want to try and keep right as much as possible for this um, left and right chicane there then we're through into, of course, the final corner there. Um, Bussini, yeah, I looked at that name, I apologize, I'm a little bit wide there. We can cut back, um, yeah, and obviously the, 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 that corner is in crucial because obviously it leads onto the main straight. No DRS, of course, for us, but um, it is a 139.1. Um, so yes, it is time though for a race. We're gonna have nine laps, so we'll be able to see how it, what it, if Mugello is going to be um, good for racing I mean if, if I remember rightly from, the, from 2020 there was a safety car obviously no safety cars today but will we be able to race and gain positions three two one go and we're once again starting from our usual 12th place in the grid it's been a poor start for the two tier Ferrari there from 1990 um, as well I think they're adding an 86 Lotus to this as well but I don't know if there's actually an F1 car I need to check that out that McLaren has gone smoking away as we had to lift off there because that Ferrari was just um, understeering into our path and would have taken us out there so we've made up one position from the start we're now trying to get past um, Ferrari we're going very slowly again the AI going a little bit too slow they tend to battle it um, they are a little bit erratic if you haven't seen this series already. I reckon you can check out the other videos as well. Um, if I haven't done so already, as the McLaren has been forced out of the clap of Ferrari. And we're going to have Die Danny inside here. And we're on the grass a bit. There's another Ferrari here. I think he's gone through, but we are up to P9. We have making another position now to another look on the outside. No, can't do this. We go up the hill. Um, so we're around the outside of Aria. Aria Rubiata, excuse me, uh, the, the rat up now up to P8 down the inside here. Can we make the move? The Ferrari, I think, has turned into us, but we have made the move up to P7. So, you know, he, he, he's been good for racing on this opening lap. But now we move to the inner lap one. Um, obviously, the big change for us will be the straight line. It seems we've got a lot of straight line speed. Look at this, how much we closed in on this Ferrari. Can we get the McLaren or two down the in middle? Um, isn't the Ferrari McLaren still there? No, we got both of them. What a little move there as well. Next up um, on lap three, we're going to blast past another McLaren and up to P4. Um, I'll say that. I mean, we have gone very wide at turn one, but we are 
so we have survived. Now up to lap four, we're making good progress. We haven't won in this series so far in Forza Motorsport in any of them, so I'm hoping that we can do that. We're going to get this McLaren instantly. I think the AI have got a lot more downforce than what the default is set up that I'm running or whatever it is on this car. That's what I think anyway. So we're now joining up the leaders. We should be able to get this McLaren here. Can we get the Ferrari as well? No, we step out. Slipstream is, is, uh, seems to be a little bit OP and the Ferrari has broken way too early. Uh, now, we have to move to the, again to lap six. Can we get the McLaren again? Um, you know, this is a great battle for the t for the lead between us two McLarens and the sole Ferrari who leads the way. Um, Ferrari breaks again offline. Um, and then all the McLarens come back at us at the inside. What a comeback from the McLaren. From our fellow McLaren who was going to be relegated to P3. We should hopefully now should be able to relegate him. But every time we pull out we lose... Um, speed because of the, the slipstream and it seems to be a little bit too OP with down the inside of the McLaren can we get this move done yes we can and finally we have to P2 but we are running out of laps we want to make this move stick uh, next up is the for the sole remaining Ferrari and I'm sorry well not the sole remaining but the sole leading Ferrari I should say and we're just going to blast past easily the Ferrari that Ferrari seems to us I don't know if it's got something wrong with damage or it's just slow I mean it wasn't the best Ferrari and ladies and gentlemen it's finally happened on Forza Motorsport I finally won a race and it's round Mugello Ferrari the Tifosi will not be happy that it's a McLaren and not the Ferrari on on top there um, Yes, that is a little uh, taste of what Mugello had to offer. Do you think that if, obviously, we ended up in a similar situation, would Mugello um, come back again? Obviously, it would have been could have been a substitute for um, Imola, because, of course, I did say at the time when Imola got cancelled, because obviously for the right reasons, because due to the flooding, hop down the road to Mugello if they've not got flooding, if they're... If, there, I, I can't quite remember if they did have flooding there in Bologna um, as well. But yeah, let me know what you think about Mugello in the comments below. If you are new around here though, then please do get subscribed for weekly Formula One content. Um, let me also let me know down in the comments below which track you want to see next and which car combination as well. So yeah, until the next video then, I'll see you next time. Take care. Thanks so much for watching. Enjoy your day and goodbye. <laughs>